Hello everyone. It's such a delight to share from the lives of godly women who've left beha- behind wonderful examples of faith for us. And today we will look at the life of Mary, the mother of Jesus, and how she trusted God and you know God did wonderful things in the life of Mary. Uh, let's look at a scripture. It's Luke 1 verse 38 where Mary says, "Behold the maid servant of the Lord let it be to me according to your word and the angel departed from her now mary was like the people of her times the devoted people of her times who was waiting for the appearance of the messiah just think about it an ordinary girl waiting for the messiah to be revealed what would happen to one of us if the angel were to come to us and say that god has chosen you you have found favor in the sight of god to be the mother of the messiah and that's exactly what happened to mary and she was uh, a simple girl she did have questions so she immediately asks the angel you know how can this be for i know not a man you know she was she was um, not someone who was pretending but she was very Uh, honest and sincere in her question and the angel of course answered her and told her that this would happen because of the holy spirit and so uh, as soon as she knew that god was going to do it in his own way her response is this in luke 138 she says i'm there are different translations in this particular translation it says the maid servant of the lord or you know somebody who is surrendered submitted to the lord i'm here to serve the lord that's what she's saying and she's saying let it be to me according to your word and that is a an example of a surrendered and a committed life you know today how many of us would would say that to god if god calls us uh, for his purposes you know there are various things that uh, need to be done in the kingdom and now god went to call us and say okay this is what i want you to do this is how i want you to serve uh, the body of christ like mary of course we may have our questions but can we come to a place where we say lord let it be to me according to your will and that's what mary did so you no know, mary is an example of yieldedness of surrender someone who gave into the purposes of god despite the questions that she had and she's also a person who believed that god can god can she was ordinary but she served an extraordinary god and so she knew that god can use anyone to release his purposes and she said okay god you know i know that you can do it through my life i can't do it but you can do it you are a great god and so she knew that god can she also just surrendered herself for the cause of christ and it wasn't easy think about it she was unmarried and to have somebody pregnant and being unmarried there was a lot of reproach which she would have experienced before the birth of jesus and even after the birth of jesus we don't know the challenges that she went through but she was willing you know taking on god's assignment and purpose may never be the easiest thing for us we may have to go through difficulties to fulfill it but you know like mary sold out for the cause of christ and that's important and of course what happened in her life was a miracle by the holy spirit and even today the holy spirit does miracles so let's be open to the working of the spirit let's pray together heavenly father we thank you that you are a great god working through ordinary people and lord your miracles are released through ordinary people and today lord we yield ourselves the way mary said be it unto me according to your word lord whatever you say yes we say yes to that in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org